What is going on everybody? Welcome back into the channel. My name is Rock Soldier and today we're going to be reacting to Money Game by Ren. I took a one video hiatus from rea reacting to Ren. We did a Linkin Park song and that was about as long as I could stay away, man. So we are back to do another Ren uh, track here. We got Money Game. I am super excited to check this one out, guys. We're going to hop right into it. Let's get it. A strange time we're living in Broken but fear in Hierarchy parties They make us feel inferior Read one through Parliament interiors Devils walk among us They fit the criteria Eerie, dairy, stripe Fearing, weary Minded men when we're clearly Living in dictatorships Nearly Blinded by illusions To choose but who's fooling who A pulled chain to your shoes I'm pain It's a crying shame The pursuit of our own wealth Lies a flame That makes greed a game The less this whole war burn as the world turns, the whole world burns But money was invented for trade But now those bits of paper Twist hearts, make slaves Turns a saint into a sinner A child into a killer His finger on the trigger of a money game Oh, rain, 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 rain A storm, it comes our way Damn. And those who rise through distorted lies Poison in the veins But we died to put in the blame it's easy uh, to blame But point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this old money game Stop hmm. Yeah, I mean I don't know if I've ever really thought of it like that, right? Like kind of the way the world works Capitalism and whatnot, right? To kind of how essential money is to our lives In so many different aspects That it kind of does create this Um stigma of get as much money as possible right it, it, and you have right because you know, therefore you can afford things that you know are stress reliefs or nice things for your family you know right less worries right um but like at what point does it become immoral right i mean it's like inherently if, if everything runs off of money uh then <clears throat> and the mindset is to get money at any cost at what point uh, do we do we cross the line, right? I mean, it's, a, it's interesting to think about. I can't say I've ever quite thought of it like that before. So that's definitely quite interesting. And his fucking voice when we went into that chorus, I was not ready for that. That rain, rain, rain. Oh my gosh. It was a little unnecessary. <laughs> Dear Mr. President, it's evident that everyone's a resident of fear when they support these ideas to keep us separate when it makes believe. Everybody is coming to terrorize you in the streets. They say badly through grit and teeth. That's my right to hate. That's feeling my speech. But when did freedom become a reason to hate? A way to justify a racist slur or insult we make? There's an irony in freedom. Cause us no. in the way, we have pillaged and put the demand that's have a discount and that's all of the rest. That's called hypocrisy. Preach a certain value that you never keep yourselves. Your country was in flames. You denigrate yourselves in a second. Still, you spit your venom. Demonizing immigrants when really you're the immigrant because all of us mm. are immigrants. I don't know. <laughs> There's a lot of people that are ready to hear this quite like this, uh, to be honest. I was not ready for this second verse to be quite the topic that it is, but it does make sense for, you know, what the song is about. Um, and kind of just basically how everything is kind of run through fear uh, and made into this money game, right? I mean, because what happens when you run out of money? Poverty, homelessness, so much more, right? And those those two ideas alone, man, can can drive people to do 
a lot of different things. But then this whole part right here where he goes into it's my right to hate, that's freedom of speech, and kind of breaks it down. And I mean, like, yeah, I mean, there's just a lot to say there on those topics, in my opinion. I mean, he's definitely right, though, right? Um, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, the whole freedom of speech thing, 100%. I mean, you, you, you can say what you want, but that definitely does not give you the right to just go hate on somebody, hate on a, a group of people for, for really no warranted reason, right? Really no justification, uh, especially to use racial slurs or insults like he said here, just, 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 just for the fuck of it, just because of, of fear, really, right? I mean, you may not even come into any kind of contact or any kind of experiences with certain people and then some people are just just racist just because of fear man i mean that's that is kind of what it boils down to and then this whole part here about about you know you know we're really the immigrants and stuff i mean like that is that's a whole nother conversation to get into at a different point but, you but it is facts yourself, your country was in flames you demigrate yourselves in a second still you spit your venom demonizing immigrants when really you're the immigrant because all of us are immigrants or descended from immigrants irony is imminent i'll shed the light on immigrants america was colonized by britain britain it was colonized by rome and also colonized by the saxons they were german by the way you know how people throw shade upon the germans because of history's pain and yet we made the same yeah. mistakes all the game demonize a whole people jewish or muslim the same and the same old situations play on repeat the same old tv shows repeat yeah we worship yeah. the bleak our opinions I was just are our that, yeah. we follow like sheep there's no left there's no right in the middle we sleep right i mean yeah i mean like we never really learn from from history right and um yeah i know i know a lot of people are probably familiar with the quote that you know those who don't learn history you're doomed to repeat it i mean and it is very much the same thing you know situations play on repeat the same old tv shows repeat yeah we worship the bleak our opinions are our own and we follow like sheep there's no left there's no right in the middle we sleep rain 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 a storm it comes our way and those who rise through distorted lights poison in the veins but we'd like to point the blame 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 it's easier to blame But point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this whole money game on this. Oh, I guess we're done with that now. That was a weird sound in the headphones. All right, so that was Money Game by Ren. As for the music video, I can't say that that's exactly where I saw the music video going. Um, it was quite interesting. And honestly, I will say, for the most part, 
I did not make a great connection with the music video to the song. Uh, so if you guys have any insight as to kind of some of the symbolism and or that was used, maybe some of the imagery that was used in the in the video uh, that was kind of there related that I maybe didn't miss, let me know down in the comments, man. But for the song itself, man, um, <clears throat> it's interesting, right? Just the, so my exposure to Ren really has kind of been about health in in some form or another, or it was kind of uh, like the tales he did of Jenny Screech and Violet, right? So to have like this topic out here too, right, is very interesting. And again, just kind of adds to his versatility for me and what, what he's able to talk about. Because uh, not everybody feels comfortable talking about something like this, especially on a, on a platform, uh, you know, that he has, right? So it's very interesting uh, to see his versatility and his willingness to kind of just you know, say say how he feels, right? Put his opinion out there, put his thoughts out there. Uh, but the song itself, man, was super catchy. I mean, his voice continues to impress me. When that first chorus came in, man, that rain, rain, I was like, oh my gosh, man, he's got such a good voice. And there was a lot of different flows uh, and paces there throughout the song that I really enjoyed. And, and the beat itself was just super kind of vibey and catchy, right? So overall, man, I gotta say the song was really well done in my opinion and i certainly enjoyed it uh, and i hope you guys did as well if you did please make sure to leave a like hit that sub button hit that bell nowhere top of the next one and that is all i got for you guys for now it's your boy rock soldier hope you have a great excuse me have a great rest of your night even better tomorrow i'll talk to you guys in the next one all right guys peace